Hello everyone, Mum's Ashley, and welcome to part three now, guys, of Creative Cove. Now I can't stop playing this game, though. I can't stop playing it, guys. So we don't do part three now, guys. As always, if you want to see more of this game, all you gotta do is simply watch video. Make sure to see If I get loads of views in this video, I'll do part four, guys. Also, like and share the video we have time as well. Also, subscribe to the channel and turn on notifications. So never miss on post. Have you? Let's continue Creative Cove. Right, we gotta talk to Pokey. Talk. Hey, Ashley, you're just who I was hoping to run into. I found something unusual on the beach and immediately thought of you. It's a bottle, but I'm pretty sure that it's got something inside of it. But there's no one touching that fin. Who knows where it's been? You always stand around touching everything with your dirty little hands, so I figured that an old grind bottle lying on the beach would be right up your alley. Follow me and I'll show you right where it is. And don't lie, Dad. I have better things to do with my day than wait for you, like whatever. Here he is. Not. Right, it, it, it's a um, to the pokey treasure map. It's a treasure map map. Cool. Wow, that is that, that is genuine treasure map. If you follow it, you'll find something cool. That's that's how treasure maps work, you know. You just find when the X marks the spot and dig. Super easy, simple, like so simple. Even you can do it. You don't need something to dig with, though. Don't look at me. Don't do I look like I'm made of, of shovels or something? Go try and tell there's probably no one on this whole island who's got more treasure than that old shot. I bet he's got a trunk full of shovels you can use. Well, I'll do my good deed for the day. Time for me to leave you to your rooting around in the dirt. Later, chompers. Guys, off camera, guys. I've I done, I done some diving. That's what I've done, guys. So, so now I can make this other thing I need to make to continue doing the workshop. Where is it? Where did where, where I put it? Aha, here, here it is. Put on my old plate, there we are. Craft a simple cutter, yes. Put a simple cutter, there we are. That is now done, now we got to place it, so inventory. Simple cutter, there we are. Lovely. Where do I put this? Right, rotate, LB. That's going to go here, yeah? Right here, there we are. Lovely. There we are, cool. Congratulations, Monax Fade. The simple car appears to be functioning correctly. This unit believes that a good god job is appropriate. Watch was now almost fully functional. The only station that is still needed is a stone cure to make bricks in. Please grab and place one so that we can bring, begin brick production. Ashley's complete, please inform that this unit. Okay, so place a stone kin. What is it, Stone King? Okay, so we need some more. Okay, so we need a, we need a campfire and we need some more stone. Let's get a shovel, yeah. Let's get a shovel though first. What we gotta do? We got to talk to um the shark. How the hell there? Talk. Tell me, what can I do for old? What can old Ant do for you? I found a treasure map. A treasure map, you'd be saying. Best be handing over before old Ant goes into a feeding frenzy, tears up you to shreds. Ha ha! That'd just be a little sharp part of humour for me for ye. Anchor's lad's shredding days are long past. So you found yourself a treasure map, did ya? Anchor knows a thing or two about treasure maps. Just find where X marks the spot and dig up, all simple, all simple like. I need a shovel. Ah, oh, so you found a treasure map and not done nothing to dig with, eh? Anchor has found himself in that very situation more times than teeth in my own head. Fortunately for you, Anchor just so happens to be an expert on making new shovels out of the bits and thought you can be fine all over. Let me share my shovel and not build knowledge with ya. After all, we can't have you on your hands and knees. Scoping out sand in a desperate attempt to get a treasure, treasure, you'd be undignified. Now, now we're taking care of good luck to G. So, blue, a few, few blue, blue print, there we are. So, base shovel, okay, cool. So, base shovel, there we are. Oh, well, that's good. We got, we got enough metal pits and sticks. There we are, cool. Lovely, jubbly. Base shovel, cool, cool, cool. Now we've got a shovel that's lovely jubbly. Lovely stone, thank you very much. Metal, just in the block, cool, cool, cool. There we are. Metal, thanks in the block, that's cool, cool, cool. What do we need? We need a kiln. So we need, some, we need a sheet of metal and we need a campfire, cool. So a sheet of metal. So we need to do some metal bars. Let's do four, yeah, four. Start it one minute, cool, cool, cool. Hello there, talk. 
Ashley, super glad I ran into you. I was thinking maybe you could help out with a little light line problem the town has. It's really dark here at night, and I hate for anyone to stub their toe because they can't see. So I figured, what if we get some new street lights installed? How do we do that? Hmm. My grandpa always said that if you want to know how something's made, you should take it apart. He destroyed so many things. I bet you look to the wrench to the broken street lights around the town to eventually figure out how to build one. You can probably do that with all sorts of things out there in the world. Once you've unlocked the secret to make the street lights, you'll be able to craft a new one out of the things you find here and there. Then it's just a matter of picking a good spot and bing bam boom, the town will have a new light. Oh, it's going to be nice to have some light when it gets so dark. That way Poe won't be able to jump out of the shadows and scare me anymore. Okay, cool. Quartz, nice. Nice, nice, nice. It's nice quartz. Now that we need some more metal plates, so so we, right, right now we're doing the stuff, which is good, good, good. Oh, what's this? Open. Oh, blocks, nice, nice, nice. Bricks, cool. Now, guys, this guys, this is also part of the part of the um the old coat hanger for the boat that we that um that um our sharky friend wants wants us to do. So <coughs> it was. And it over to build me a ship that I can use to travel to nearby, so who knows what sorts of treasure they might hide. So we need a lot, so we got that, we need a bar. Hey there. Holy whiskers, you're looking clean naked, Ashley. You worry worked so hard for all of us that you've gone to take care of yourself. Maybe you should get s yourself something to eat and some rest. Don't know about you, but I always feel better if I get myself some nice grilled meat. It's also so simple to make. The first thing I do is pop down a campfire, then I just toss in a drumstick and wait for it to roast up nicely. Hmm, hmm. Just thinking about it is making my mouth water. But if grilled meat isn't your thing, you can try putting anything you want into it. The funny thing about cooking is just trying to figure out new recipes. I think it's something you should get some sleep. You've been in your bed, you've a bed in your home for a reason, Ashley. Use it. Let's not see. I hope you aren't looking so tired. You've got to take care of yourself, Ashley. Cool. Right, let's build um, a campfire then. Let's put up some more sticks. Stick and stones may break my bones, love each other. Right, campfire, so we got done that. <coughs> campfire. But let's, we need to build two of them because we need a campfire for the stone kiln. Let's do another one, so. Oops. Another campfire, thank you. Thank you. Love each other. Right, there we are. We've got, so we've got two campfires. Nice, nice, nice. Bit of metal. Thank you, Benny. Thank you. Oh, in inventory is full of shit. Right, open. Let's put, um... Cinder blocks, yes, away there. And that. Yeah, there we are. And there we are, lovely. Pick up these. Lovely. Right, that's good. Now, now we've got, now we've got to make... Now we've got to craft metal plate. How, how, how many do we need for it, for the stone kiln? We need one, that's fine, one. And we need some more stones, that's fine. So we need one metal plate. Let's do two, yeah? Do two. There we are. And oh, there we are. And we need some more stone. And for, and, so yeah. Let's go to the minute or two. Right, let's do some more stones, yeah? Let's get some more stones. Quartz, lovely, lovely. There we are, some more stones, lovely. Wood, stones, or we can just do that as well. Stone. <coughs> Dig for this. There we are, lovely. There we are, some more wood, lovely, lovely. Right. That's gonna take me. That's that's gonna take about a minute to to um do it. So let's go to the, let's go to the other side of the beach, yeah? Because 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 the chicken legs. Because I, I think the chicken fins fin are here. I think where this where this tent is. I think I think I think it is. Yeah, here they are. Gather drum stalks. Drum stick stalks. Cool. Lovey jubbly, lovey jubbly. 
More stones, lovely. Just let me need some more stones. A shell. There we are. Well, let's dive over to um to the let, let, let's dive over to the workshop. Yeah, build a stone kiln. We also got some berries as well. Yeah, that's now done. Lovely. Oh, inventory is full again. Jesus Christ. Quartz. Sandal. All these shells we could We could sell them, but. Yeah, you know. Trying fruit, cool, cool, cool. Strange layers, lovely, jubbly. Right, pick up this. There we are. Let's do the stone kiln. There we are. Woohoo! Lovely, jubbly, guys. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Now we got to place down the stone kiln. So, inventory. Where's the stone kiln? There we are, stone kiln. There we are, lovely. We gotta rotate it. Right, guys, 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 at least this one, guys, we know where the entrance is, yeah? At least this one, we know where the entrance is, which is good, good, good. There we are. <laughs> this unit seems to actually have completed the task of creating a stone kiln and finishing the task of getting this workshop fully operational. Now, a fully operational workshop, we are prepared to be begin repairs on structures in town. Unfortunately, this unit lacks the day on how these meat person structures function. This unit requests to actually speak with Renard and see how he wishes to remedy this situation. Once the data is found on, the, on those buildings, please return to me again. Farewell mode activated. This unit found working with Ashley most efficient. Cool. Let's get rid of some more stuff. So let's get rid of, get rid of these stones. Metal plates. Metal beams. Hi there, Renard. But look at that, you managed to save top bottom and uh, get the workshop operational. I knew I was right to put my faith in you, Capital. Now that it's done, I need to speak with a representative of the local tourism board. He's done to help make Critter Cove the next to hot tourist destination. I believe his name is Checkmart or something. He'll know what to do next in order to start welcoming wealthy travellers to our wonderful city. And wealthy travellers means part of the blooms. Just go see what he has to say and do whatever he asks. It's uh, imperative that you get this all sorted. Every day we're not open for business is more lost profit. I've every faith that you'll do a particular do spectacular job. Thank you. <coughs> now where is that um right the resource found that stout ship right one. So we died over there. So we gotta go straight on, so we died over there. Yeah we died yeah boat, yeah? So we got to do some diving, I'm not sure where right right straight around. There's the bath! Weehee! Pick up. Thank you. Tub. Huh. Learn this. <laughs> Recipe learn furniture work tell. Tool, tool, tool. And we got a dig as well, so let's dig this. Dig. Oh, it's treasure chest. Whoa! Recipe learn cooking station. Woohoo! Yeah, man, wicked. Cooking station unlocked. Yes! Get some more drumsticks. Some more berries. More drumsticks. There we are. Lovely. Let's dive over to the shark. To Mr. Sharkman. Sharkman! Na 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 na, Sharkman! <laughs> Here we are, Mr. Sharkman. Talk. Have you managed to find the supplies and needs to make your ship yet? I have something for you. <laughs> Sing me! I think, I think that's supposed to be F me, I think. F me! You found all the parts that I'd be needing to fix you up a ship. And this work will be a fine vessel, I tell you. Well, as fine as a vessel can, that can be made out of tub and lumo engine any, anyhow. Oh, and it's going to be starting, getting started on putting her all together for you. While you'll be waiting, for, while you be waiting you should go let Renard know that you'll be having a ship soon. He's been yapping me gills off about asking about when you'd have one. I'm sure by the time you found out what the, that landlord rat be wants, I'll be having the ship put together. Thank you. Let's go to the workshop. Hello, the top bottom. Right, so what's next? Oh, so zero is the resource finder. Cool. What's our other job teams? Right. Talk to Renard, light of the town, out of stamina. 
Oh yeah, yeah, we got, yeah, we've got to um, put, our, put down our thingy, don't we? Let's put this here, yeah? So let's, let's do a campfire, so let's start in inventory, note that's the map. Inventory, we need a campfire. There is campfire, there we are. Place it here, please, and thank you. Right. Add fuel. Some sticks. Here we are, start cooking. But we're going to cook drum stalk, yeah? That's it, experiment. Okay, pick up grilled meat, cool. Grilled meat, that's good, good, good. Eat it. There we are, lovely. And that's how you get a stamina back, yeah? Haha, <laughs> to the top of my tape. Greens mode that's fair. Greens Ashley, this unit hopes you are having a quality day. This unit realised that Ashley still does not have a clothing manufacturing machine. Now you have a vessel to travel in and you'll be able to crowd and place one. Me person needs some method of making cloth, twine and other clothing items in order to look acceptable and not freeze. Workbench already comes equipped with the instructions on how to build a loom. But Ashley will need to travel to Hot Tropic in order to salvage a broken version to build a new one. Okay. Once Ashley has crafted and placed a new loom, this unit will examine it in order to make sure it is in good working order. Farewell, you will do well in this task. This unit will now return to its normally scheduled routine. Now I've got to talk to Renard. Renard, where are you, Renard? Here he is. Ashley, I've heard the Anki is helping you procure your very own ship. That is most opp opp opportune news. You can use your boat to explore the many islands beyond our shores, all of which hold the resources needed to support our community. Most importantly are the people who can be found on them. If we are ever to grow, we're going to need to get more people to move here. It'll be up to you to act as an ambassador and sell them at the dream of Creative Cove. I'm sure some of your talents will, will have no trouble, no trouble at all. And as luck would have it, I've already figured out the first place you should start looking. I have on the good good authority that a sail is stuck in the nearby island of shallow sands. If you were to say sail up to this poor soul and offer assistance, I bet they'd be so grateful they'd, they'd jump at the chance to move here. Yes, yes, that settles it. You will go to shallow lands immediately. Good luck, Ashley. Okay, now, we, now we've also got to talk to, to the other guy, Mr. Checkmark. <coughs> Wherever he is, I don't know where Checkmark is. Okay, guys, I'm guys, not sure where Checkmark is. Oh, here he is, Checkmark. Talk. Hello there, you must be Ashley. I'm Checkmark and I'll be your local contact to the tourism board. Tourism board? Um, yes, I assume, I assume Renard must have told you. But perhaps it slipped his mind. Tourism board helps get towns in this region ready to accept guests. It's our job to set up a shop in these backwater towns and make sure they're up to current standards before we literally add, add them to travel maps. Tourism shop offers a wide array of blueprints, decorations and other goodies that you're going to need in order to turn this town into a prime pr prime destination. First of all, you're going to need to get that old lighthouse function. If you want cruise ships to ever arrive, you're going to need to let them know you're ready for business. Fortunately, Renard has already made arrangements in that regard. I put together a list of supplies that will need to to procure procured in order to repair the lighthouse. Pin it to the door of the lighthouse and you'll be supplied with a donation box for all the need, need resources. Once you finish filling the box, you ha your handy bot top bottom will take care of the rest. It means I need to set up shop. Talk to me again when the lighthouse is up and running. Good luck, Ashley. It was most agreeable to meet you. Cool. Let's talk to Mr. Shark Boy. Anchor, be anchor. Talk. There we go. I must say she's a fine looking craft. Well, she'd be a craft anyways. Congratulations. You're now officially captain of your own ship. One more thing is it's law of the sea that a new captain gives his ship a na new name. Trust me, you don't want to break the laws of the sea. Once sea lawyers get involved, you're stunned. So you've got, got your name in mind? Okay. I'm thinking SS... SS... Um, they are the SS Ash. <laughs> the SS Ash. <laughs> I know it's a shitty name, so accept. Are oh, you sure you want to call her SS Ash? Don't worry too much since you can always change it later. Yes, it is a fine name for a fine vessel. Treat her well as she will probably never sink on you. And if she does, tell David Jones that Angus says ahoy. I don't understand a door can like laying landlubber while he's done it. Hop in and take her for a spin. We're not going to do that, guys, in, the, in this episode. Guys. We're going to go to the, to the um, lighthouse and pop on the. Pop on the. Um, we're going to pop on the deed. That's what I meant to say. <laughs> Pin the door. That's what we need. 
We got some glass. We got some. Oh, we got. We got. We got enough plants. That's good. We need some glass. Lighthouse light. Wood plank, glass, and stone slabs. We need more glass and stone slabs. Okay, stone slabs. We need more. There. Right, right. We got. Right, we got the wood slabs. That's nice, nice, nice. Right, right. Let's all, let's all take down some. Actually, no. There's light. There's light here anyway. So, dismantle. Do we get glass? Yes, we've got some glass. Cool. Oh, some more oil. Glass, nice, nice, nice. There's another one here. Oh. <laughs> there you are, wood plants. That's all. Wow. <laughs> now, I do believe I saw one over here, right? Oh, I, I must have picked up already. <laughs> That's fine. It was here, so I must I must pick up already. How much glass we need we've got now? Seven, okay, seven. How, how many glass do we need? Is it ten, right? <gasps> yeah, sweet lamp, cool, nice. I'm exhausted. Okay, I'm exhausted. <laughs> well, let's go to bed, yeah, let's go to bed. We just gotta find our house. <laughs> That's lighthouse, no. We can't run when we get exhausted, okay? That's fine. It's 9 pm, not bad, not bad, not bad, yeah? Let's go to bed, yeah, let's go to bed, and we're gonna end the video, guys. Okay guys, that's going to do part 3 guys of Critical. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to leave a like and I'll see you next time. Goodbye!